So I'm on Laurel Canyon Boulevard and I'm driving to interview the odd girls, Sophie Tilson and Chandra Wakefield. That's how you say it, Chandra. Full name. They're Australian and they're living, or at least I know this is Chandra's house. She lives in the Hollywood Hills and we're heading there now. And according to Tom Tom, it's not very far away from my house, which I love. And after that, I actually have a big audition for Honey 2, Jessica Alba. You know you saw it. Uh, and that's it. So hopefully I won't get lost because in the hills there's no reception. So Tom, if Tom Tom fails me, screwed. What? Are you serious? Okay. Wow. Yeah. So, I have eight miles left before I run out of gas. And it's so great that I'm on the hills because there's so many gas stations here. Uh, always happens. The whole Oscar idea come about. Did you guys know each other before you started the project? No, we didn't know each other. Um, Nick, the creator of Oz Girls, just approached me and said that he wanted to create a web series, but he didn't really know. Okay, so I just left uh, Shandra's house. Um, the girls were awesome. They were so sweet. Sophie was uh, jetting off somewhere. She's actually just staying at Chandra's house. But uh, right now, I am speeding down the Hollywood Hills. Alright, here's my little wardrobe change. Yeah, very hip hop. So I have an audition now for Honey 2 for the lead, uh, Maria. And I was just debating whether I should keep my cowboy boots on because I can turn better in the boots or whether I should sport my sneaks, but uh, I think I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm really digging my boots. I think I'm gonna do that. Okay, this is annoying. So I found the lot, but they're not paying for parking for the audition, so we have to either find street parking, which is clearly impossible in this area, or right here, Athena parking. Hmm. It's just so ridiculous that they don't pay for parking. Usually, I mean, even if you have a studio lot audition, I mean, they always do. They just park on the lot. I mean, there's like a gazillion spaces. I don't, it's so dumb. Ugh, I'm just gonna kill all of these people. Ooh, fruit guy. Yummers. So, I guess I'm gonna park in this lot, or maybe, I'm gonna see if there's street parking too. You know, I'm like, look, I'm not a fan of paying for parking when there's just all this space. Ugh. And I don't even understand what the guy told me about, like, walking on to some bullshit. I don't know what the fuck I am. Oh, look. There's a meter. Yay. Four-hour parking. Just needs 7,800 quarters, but it'll be fine. Awesome. Okay. Now I gotta truck it from here. Here we go. Honey, too. I'm irritated. Ugh. So, okay. Thank God I brought my backpack, right? I just have to pay for the parking. Listen, it's not like I'm a Jew or anything. It's just all my Jewish friends don't get insulted. I'm just, it's so annoying. Usually you just go to the audition and you just park a lot, you know? I don't um, to walk with my boots. So I don't know where. And it's $6 all day and it's just $6 for an hour. It's just $6 even if you stay for six minutes. So... I'm going to spend the whole day downtown to take advantage of my all-day parking pass. <sighs> Definitely buy some fruit from this guy. Still walking. I don't really know where it is. The guy at the gate asked me if I was here for Mad Men. I should have said yes. Probably would have let me park in the lot. Wait, gate five. Is that where I'm supposed to go? How do I get to where I'm going? Why does it take me so long? 
Oh, look, a bunch of taxi people. They probably know where to go. Let's see. They all look at me like they want to eat me. It's so scary. Hi. How do you get to 1201 West 5th Street? That's it? I'm here? Yeah. Oh, the other side? Oh, oh Lord. Him. Maybe he's going to give you a way to go. To go through? Okay. I need, like, special access? I can do it. Let me try. Thank you. All right. So that was... I don't understand anything. Oh. I thought it was locked. I was like, why is it so complicated to find this place? Okay. All right. <laughs> Okay, wait. So I go through the building? Yes, directly through the exit out the building. Yeah. Okay. All right, thank you. What the fuck? This is like, I can't. I'm serious. Honey, two. Never in my life have I had to trek so far for an audition. I mean, literally, it looks like I'm going, like, backpacking. So this is not Europe. Okay, go through the building, go to the right, get on the other building, get to the third floor. Woo! I'm going to be exhausted by the time I get up there. Weird people behind me. Got to go. Awesome. Hmm. Maybe I should audition for Blue Crush while I'm here. <sighs> Mamma mia. Okay, I'm here. Here we go. Let's do the third floor. I'm feeling good about it. You know, I blessed the move. I brought my iPod. So the casting director told me that was smart because they had no music. We wanted to see the end, so it was just kind of like, so no music. So, so we'll see what happens. Oh, and P.S. Casting director loved my boots. I told him I had some kicks, you know, in my bag, but but he said he loved the boots. So. Yay! Looks like they're shooting something here. I'm not supposed to be walking around here. I don't really care. Whatever. I'm just gonna walk through here. <laughs> These are one of my trailers. I'm lame. Alright. How the hell do I get out of here? What did I just step on? The day is over and I am so happy. I really am. I'm exhausted. I'm totally just going to eat and watch my Hulu.com, watch my shows, and just lounge out. This is what I do when I get home. I'm hungry. Listen, I'm really into healthy food, but if I want a piece of pizza or hamburger, I won't eat that shit. But this is what I usually... um cook up for myself. The greens. I love to make my own hummus. So lots of garlic. <laughs> it's just me here. So um, always make a salad with my yummy olive oil. And then I'll probably just heat up some chicken that I made from last night. And uh, I'm going to have myself a little feast here. So 